What's the story with Christchurch's drinking water? And what's being done to ensure we have a safe supply now and into the future? Christchurch has some of the best drinking water in the world. It comes from the Waimakariri River to the north and from rainfall to the west and north of the city. River and rainwater seeps into the underlying gravels and flows through the aquifers towards Christchurch. The responsibility for ensuring safe drinking water is held by three agencies, Environment Canterbury, Christchurch City Council and the District Health Board. Environment Canterbury's role is to protect drinking water at source by ensuring contaminants aren't getting into fresh water. For Christchurch, this is done by tight restrictions on the use of the land north of the city. This area is mainly recreational areas, low impact farming, along with the airport. Christchurch City Council is responsible for the wells, pipes and pumps, and ensuring water is safe when it comes out of the tap. If their monitoring does show a contamination risk, the council will treat drinking water with UV or chlorine, or will repair infrastructure where necessary. The Ministry of Health appoints drinking water assessors who are employed by the District Health Board to oversee the impact of water quality on your health. The community is then advised when there is a risk to our health and action needs to be taken. For example, a temporary boil water notice may be issued. Things run a little differently for people on a private supply. If you have your own well, you are responsible for testing and ensuring your water is safe to drink. This can be as easy as turning on the tap taking a sample and sending it to the laboratory for analysis, as well as ensuring that your wells are protected. As you can see, many agencies have a role to play in protecting Canterbury's drinking water quality, and we all must work together to ensure everyone has a safe supply now and into the future.